Marilyn Mosby was indicted on four counts by the Department of Justice. And today, Baltimore City's top prosecutor appeared in court for her pre-trial hearing. WMER 2 News' Kendall Green live for us at the U.S. Courthouse downtown. Kendall, not a good day in court for our city state's attorney. Yeah, you're right. Good evening, Kelly. The defense, they filed three uh, motions in this pretrial hearing that were ultimately shot down by Judge Grisby this afternoon. Now, the judge saying that the superseding indictment laid out elaborate details in the case against State's Attorney Mosby. The motions were to request a hearing of a bill of particulars to dismiss the indictment entirely or to disqualify the lead prosecutor, Leo Wise, in the case because of an alleged personal vendetta against Mosby. Her lawyer, attorney A. Scott Bowden, alleged this case stemmed from, quote, selective and vindictive prosecution fueled by personal animus. He alleged the lead prosecutor's contributions to Mosby's opponents for the state's attorney's office supported their personal agenda against her. The government, said, the government says that's just not true. Mosby's attorney argues that without the genuine personal animus, the case wouldn't have gone forward. U.S. attorneys called it just another play in the political playbook. The judge ruled saying that the defense didn't show objective evidence that prosecutors acted in personal animus and again rejected all three motions. We caught up with the state's attorney Mosby and her legal team for reaction. And here's what they had to say about it. Uh, I think more disappointed than surprised. Um, the facts of, of, of this case for the motion to dismiss uh, ought to be troubling to the U.S. attorney and the Department of Justice. Um, these facts that were documented and truthful. Uh, while they may not have risen to the level for the court to dismiss the charges, uh, they're problematic. It doesn't affect my election. I've been victorious every um, single time they've come for me. I'll be victorious again. Victory I've won every single time. State ethics, state board of elections, suits, harassment. I've won every time and I'll win this time. Now that this pretrial hearing is wrapped up, this uh, this trial will. Now that this pretrial hearing is wrapped up, this trial will begin September 19th. And of course, we'll stay on top of things on air and online at WMAR2News.com. Reporting in downtown Baltimore, Kendall Green, WMAR2 News. All right, thanks a lot, Kendall. And on the same day of this pretrial hearing, Marilyn Mosby officially filed for re-election as the Baltimore City State's Attorney. The primary is July 19th. The Democratic primary race already includes defense attorney Ivan Bates and former Maryland Deputy Attorney General Theroux Vignaraja.